hi, Jessica Lyon here, Project Manager of the Phoenix Firestorm Project. I wanted to talk to you in this video a little bit about the de-render feature in Firestorm. Um, previous to version 4.4.0, you only had one de-render capability, which was to permanently blacklist an object. With the release of 4.4.0, we give you the ability to choose whether you want to permanently blacklist the object or temporarily de-render the object. And I'm, I'm going to try to explain to you the differences between the two. So when you blacklist something, which you can get from your right-click menu, let me just move my camera here so that you can see this rock. I'm going to use this rock as an example. So when you right-click on this rock or anything that you want to get rid of, basically, something that you don't want to see, this can also be a person, um, and it can even be yourself. I believe. Um, so with the more, more there's a de-render option in, in version 4.4.0, there's a choice now, temporary or blacklist. Let me explain the differences between the two. First, I'm just going to do the temporary. Now it's gone. It's still there. In fact, I'll walk into it if I walk forward. But it's not visible to me. But it's temporary, which means that if I log out and log back in, I'll see it again. If I teleport out and teleport back in, I will see it again. And in fact, I'll show you how to do that. Let me just open up my teleport history. And I will go to our, let's say, the Firestorm meeting area where we have our meetings. Let me just teleport there. And then I will teleport right back again to the support region. And I find myself not where I was. So I'll go back to our little rock here. Should be right around here. And poof, it's just reappeared. And that's because I only temporarily de-rendered it. Now, if I were to, on the other hand, do a blacklist de-render. So let me do more, more, de-render. And then click blacklist. It'll do the same thing. It'll disappear for me and I won't be able to see it anymore. But if I teleport out and teleport back, it's going to stay gone. And in fact, what we've had a lot of people do is accidentally de-render things or de-render their friends or themselves, and they can't get themselves back, or they can't get their friends back, they can't get the objects back that they de-render because they don't know how. So let me show you how that works. When you blacklist a object through de-render, you're basically adding it to a list. And that list can be found from world, Click down here to Acid Blacklist, and this will give you a list of all the things that you have permanently de-rendered. In my case, I've only de-rendered one item ever, which was this big ivy rock. Um, that's actually not true. I've, I've de-rendered a lot of things, but I often go back in here and I'll remove them after. So I can go in here, say I want to get this rock back, or if you've de-rendered your friend, you can, or your house, <laughs> or your hair, you can go back and recover it by clicking on this clicking remove selected items from blacklist, close that, and then teleport out and teleport back in again. So let me just teleport back out to the meeting area. I've gone to a different region here and I will teleport back into my location with the rock. Oh, I can see it over there. And the rock has come back and that is how de-render works basically there, there's two options now with 4.4.0 you can uh, have the the old style which was permanently blacklist de-render and then you can also do temporary de-render which only lasts per session or for the amount of time that you're in that region as soon as you teleport out or in some cases as well a temporary de-render if there are scripts in the object sometimes the scripts will cause it to reappear again and um, that's one of the nice things about blacklist um, de-renders. Hope that explains a few things with the de-render option and um, if you've de-rendered things in the past and you've never been able to get them back, check out World Acid Blacklist and see if you've got stuff in there that maybe you've de-rendered and you don't remember. Teleport out, teleport back in, you should see them back again. See you in the next video.